Yeah. Okay. So, so, these so are all, said, the other thing too, yep. these are all recyclable, biodegradable as well. Oh, nice. So, nice. So environmentally friendly. Yeah. Yeah. It's environmentally friendly. Oh God. Sweet and tender hooligan. You know what's, you know what's sad? I think DJC, I don't think he's like a bad guy or anything. I just think he just got like taken in by the hoopla of the Amico. Like he seems to have, you know, a genuine knowledge about games and stuff. And, you know, seems seems like a decent dude, but I just I just don't understand why anyone would still be excited for the Miko in 2022. Um, but I have to say, I've always seen the people, the detractors, and the way you handle them. And I was telling John, I was like, the way Tommy handles those people online is just fantastic. Like, oh, just well, you want I to get myself in trouble sometimes because I got a bit of a big <laughs> mouth and an East Coast Italian attitude sometimes, and that. <laughs> That sometimes doesn't mix well with with anonymous haters hiding behind the screen. But you know, I try to I try to learn from my mistakes. But I always, <laughs> you know, the important thing is you're always up front. You're always honest. Yep. And if yep. people don't believe you, then that's that's their choice. That's right. okay. Yeah. But you know, when you have nothing to hide, and when you yeah. always tell the truth, then you don't have anything to hide. You know. Yeah. yeah, like he doesn't seem like a bad guy. Some of the other guys, oh, they're a little bit out there. 